<laughs> hey, buddy. Hey, guess how much gold I have. Le leave me alone. Leave me alone, please. Guess how much gold I have. Guess how much. Unlimited. I have unlimited gold. Fucking kill me. Nothing really just uh, wakes me up like a good morning of debauchery. You know what I'm saying, buddy? You know what I'm saying? He's still recovering, you know, but uh, it got wild. It got wild. So uh, it's a nice morning out. Uh, you know, Rob Nicotola told me. He's the, uh, the weatherman around here. He said it's got to be raining for most of the morning, but this, sh this should clear up in the afternoon. And that's fine, because I got something to do. I still have to pour over some old Yiddish texts I have. Acqu apparently, according to them, this is before I went to bed. Uh, according to these texts here, there's an old legend of a power that you can use to have unlimited gold. Like a, uh, like a giant room full of shekels. Like the Scrooge has. I'm just gonna sit here and pour over these books I have, try to figure out exactly where this power is because by God, I could use some fucking gold after buying that stupid horse. The thing runs like five miles per hour, it takes me forever to get anywhere. It's cute as shit, I'll give you that, it's a cute horse. But man, I'm, I'm up to my nipples in debt. Debt collector, I found out what that orc was doing outside. He's a fucking debt collector. That's what he was doing out there. So I killed him and made him my bedmate. But, uh, do you like my new helmet? See, what it does is it really protects my nose from any possible bashings it could take. I mean, this thing's sticking out a little ways, I'm not gonna lie. I, I'm not sure if you guys have noticed. Alright, I didn't want to bring it up. It's always weirded me out, you know, talking about it. And I know some of you aren't very perceptive. But, uh, I have a slightly, abnormally large nose. But I avoid conflict at every twist and turn. Yeah, fuck it. I'm gonna be daring. It's out in the, it's out in the rain, and I don't want to get a cold. But by God, I'll risk it for some gold. That kind of rhymed. Thankfully, I found out the uh, the location of the secret ancestral spell. Is actually quite nearby to White Run, a place that I frequent. So I know the terrain pretty well, and uh, and I think. I might be able to get some more information on the way. Oh, my journey has brought me by the Lorius farm again. No point in wasting my time sitting here with lost causes, you know what I mean? I mean, I got myself to think about here. Okay, I got future investments I want to uh, I want to take into account. Hey, the East Empire Trading Company, you know, I'd like to buy some stocks in that. Maybe my family would be happy with some fucking money. You know, I mean, that company's doing nothing but going up. This old Yiddish text I was reading, they said that the spell was located within a cavern. So I asked a Whiterun guard, I said, hey, do you know of any caverns around here? He said, yeah, dude, I know some caverns, but I'm going to have to bust your balls on this one. Apparently there's some poachers around there, so you need to watch the fuck out. And I said, listen here, motherfucker, do I look like I'm even... Hey! Hey, I'm talking! Do I look like I'm even afraid of that kind of shit? Bah! Look at this. Bah! Bah! I take this shit out any day of the fucking week, dude. I don't give a fuck. You know? Motherfucker acting like I have a problem with fucking... Holy fucking God damn it! Jesus Christ. Well, I guess I found the caverns. Hey! Get your fucking little snoot off that. That's mine. Ah! Shit! Damn, dude. There's a lot of dead stuff back... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, dear God. Is that what I think it is? Is that what I think it is? Oh, I'm gonna have to risk it. For the biscuit. Ah! Ah, I've been a bussin' nut. Oh, shit. I got it, though. 18 gold. Well, guard said there's bandits in here. I mean, I wanna have fuck you money. I wanna have money where I can ask Maven Blackbriar for a, a luncheon. And she'll break an appointment to eat with me. That's the kind of money I want. Alright, and by the way, that's a lady I can respect. Okay? 
that late her business tactics she is brutal brutal okay ah they got a bear trap ah shite ow fuckers yo cool it cool it uh oh oh lord get up get up we gotta run see this is interesting because uh because i wasn't planning on this and so i'm really not equipped to whoop this ass did you get fucking beat up by the fucking mammoth head look at you stuck on the rock oh you big silly bitch let me show you what's up check this out check this out you gotta come in with one of these and then you're gonna walk close and you're gonna be like that's right bitch learn your fucking place all right i came here i'm not a i'm not a natural fighter i think everyone can uh i think everyone knows that stop stepping on things but what i will fight for my friend what I will fight for till the day I die is the possibility of becoming rich. Okay, and so when I was told there was shit here, and by God there's shit here, I'm looking, I'm looking right fucking at it. What is this? What the fuck is this? Leather boots, some iron ore, potion of strength, silver ore. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's real nice. Oh, the nicest of all. But wait. I found it. Transmute mineral ore. This is... This was the gift that was promised. With this simple book, I will be able to transmute one piece of unrefined iron ore to silver, or one piece of silver ore to gold. This is the power. This is the very essence of my race. <sighs> I feel like I've been penetrated. Iron ore, iron ore, iron ore. Let's try it out, shall we? <sighs> oh, that's nice. Oh, that's real nice. <sighs> Been a, been a bus nut. Ah, oh, that's. Ooh, have you ever seen a man that is so in tune with his racial abilities? Let's do the math here. I have a piece of iron ore. It's worth two gold. Now, after transmuting it twice, it's worth fifty gold. It's twenty-five times the value. That, my friends, is a nice investment. I don't need to call up the High Counselor of Skyrim, Donald Trump, and our Lord and Savior to tell me that this is a damn good investment, okay? This is damn good. So it looks like I better be breaking bricks, wet nips, because I got some fucking gold to get. Wait, wait, wait. 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 Even better. Oh my god. Oh my god. I may have just come up with the best scheme of all time to get rich or die trying. I'm gonna go work these merchants like a couple fucking bareback whores. It took all damn day to scramble out of that fucking pit. Where the fuck is the blacksmith when I need her? Hey, what are you doing back here, lady? I gotta talk. Got some good pieces out here if you're looking to buy. I want a shop from you. She does, she's not selling it. You're not selling anything. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. What is up, you sexy man hunk? We got business to take care of. I want all your iron ore, my friend. Oh, yeah. Bah! Yes? Are you jealous of this? Side. She doesn't even know about the I old shekel. The old shekel pinch. Ready? Look at that silver ore right in my pocket. Hmm? What are you doing over here? What, what are you doing? Oh, you're rubbing a knife on a piece of leather. That's fucking great. That's great. I don't know how that's going to get you money, but you keep doing that. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's not like you're living in this piece of shit. Look at this. Place needs a new roof. You're fucking... You got moss growing over your front columns. Place is a real shithole, but, you know, if you just want to keep rubbing the knife on the thing and not taking hints over here, I have insight, man. I'll tell you. I'll tell you how to do it if you just ask. She ain't gonna ask, I ain't gonna tell her. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse, ma'am. 
Ma'am, you're not supposed to be in the water. Check this out. Party trick. Bam. Silver. In my pocket. Eat shit. Die. Get the fuck out of here. Do da do da do da do da do da do da do 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 Taking care of business. Alright, I Taking care of business and working every time. What? I'm out of ore. How much do I have? Oh my. That's a lot of gold. Alright. Let's go turn this into gold ingots. Do you get to the cloud district very often? Oh, what am I saying? It's right back the fuck up, dude. He stopped talking mid-sentence because he saw the amount of gold I had coming out of my shirt pockets. All right, I have so much, I can't even keep it in my regular pockets. You know, I have, I have it sticking out the titty pockets. But this isn't all. That's just one city among all these cities. Each city has a blacksmith. I could be up to my nipples in gold. Carriage! Carriage man! I need to take me to every hold in this fucking world. What do you say? Climb and back and we'll be off. Dawnstar, this place is cold. God, I'm so tired. Take a look. I'd like to purchase all of your iron ore. Hey, what's going on here? What's all this? Is this a mining operation? What kind of what kind of shit we got going in here? Iron breaker. Oh. Hey, I might have hit the jackpot. Iron ore. Perfect. Ba! 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 Bang! Bong! Bazinga! Shekels in my pocket. Alright. I've stripped this mine of everything it has. I've totally depleted the one economic anchor this fucking entire town has. There seems to be some issues with Windhelm. I came here to... Look, I'm gonna plead my case. Right here, okay? I understand you're angry for what I did. I may have come back and killed all of my bandit friends that were kind of near here, and I'm sorry for that. Okay, I really am. But there's no need to, uh... I can't do hard time, come on. I can't do it. I'd rather die. I can pay with your blood. No, I'm not gonna fight you. <laughs> ah! I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, I just gotta go. Maybe I'll come back to Windhelm at another time. Excuse me, carriage guy, if you could just punch it. Just, yeah, I need a ride fucking yesterday, please. Please fucking do it. Let me... Can I get on? Listen, ladies. Listen. Ladies, please. Give me a chance. I... I'm not this bad, I promise you. I'm not... I, I can't take this. I'm a... I'm a... I'm a horrible criminal. Don't follow me deep into the woods. I kept telling them, I kept telling them I didn't want this. I didn't want this, but they pushed me. And you don't push me when you're between me and gold. You heard them. You heard them. I, I sheathed my weapons and I walked away. And what did they do? They kept pushing me. They kept pushing me. And now look at what you did. You got yourself killed. Oh, thank God. They're just a couple refugees, all three of them. No one will remember these people. So, uh, I think it's probably in my best interest if I stay away from, if I stay away from Windhelm for a while. The people around here are pretty angry at me for some reason. I haven't really pinned down what it is I did wrong. But I I'm gonna, I'm gonna avoid these people. I don't even know why I came to Falkreath. This place is deader than dead. Nobody here has anything. I remember these days. Toiling away. Stealing other people's crops just for a couple shekels. Look at the way you're looking at me. You're wondering how did I get this rich? Well partner, you know it took some initiative in a, uh, a little flick of the wrist But uh, maybe one day you two Can have the money I have you know and you won't be in the middle of Falkreath the poorest Fucking place huh? in this game back the fuck up, dude. You know what fuck you. I'm pushing your card over out of the way Fuck you huh? Bop! Flick of the wrist Excuse me, ma'am. Important man coming down the road. Fucking idiot. Learn your manners, you know? It's like, learn when they're, they're a superior's coming over here. And it's, it... <sighs> Apparently she didn't see my coin purse as I was dragging by. Thing looks like a fucking... Looks like Santa's sack over his shoulder. But it's all mine, bitch. It's all mine! Only a day's ride from now, I'll be in Markarth, sipping the wine of champions. 
buying up all the iron ore I can get my little dick beaters on. You know what? I'm gonna stop right here and dab to that. Markarth, the jewel of the west, and coincidentally a place where mining is part of their penal system. So I'm thinking, come in here, buy some free as fuck ore from a bunch of prisoners. That's a win-win. Hey, guys, how you doing? Uh, couldn't help but notice one of you miners escaped in the at the entrance of Markarth. You know, he's starting some trouble, I'm not going to lie. So I uh, took the liberty of nabbing his clothes. Huh? Now we're like the same guy. Look at us. Do you mind if I, uh, do you mind if I come on in? And where's the, where's the mine at? Where's the, where's the mine at? Hmm? Oh, I found it. It's called Sidna Mine. I've been city to city, I'll admit. And now I only have 162 gold. Now, I told you this was a money-making exercise, and I'm not done making my money. All right, because you got to spend money to fucking flip a profit, my friend. You got to spend money to make money, all right? That's one thing Warren Buffett told me when uh, we had our luncheon last week. And he also told me that there's two things in life that are certain, masturbation and taxes. I'm loaded up on all the resources I need to make myself a fortune, and now I got to sleep. You know, <laughs> before I... Fucking hell, where did they keep going? Ugh, that was nice sleep, nice sleep. You know what, it looks like a beautiful day to finish what I started. Alright, my friend. You wait right here, buddy. Alright, because I'm, I'm going to go get us more shekels than you can possibly imagine. And then I'll be able to afford to pay for you. Because right now, you're kind of a detriment. To, uh, to my finances. Beautiful. And now, the peace de resistance. The shit that's gonna make me somebody in this fucking world. I will no longer be Shekelstein. I want to be Lord Shekelstein. We're all settled for Thane, I guess. You know, I feel, I feel like maybe, you know, might be my uh, ancestral heritage to be a, a jeweler. You know, I feel like maybe uh, somewhere if there's if there's other Shekelsteins out there, maybe they might be into jewelry too. You know, diamonds or something like that. Hey, hey, hey! Do I have something for you, uh, lady? Could you get the fuck out of here? The men are doing business. Welcome to war, man. The finest weapons and armor. You're goddamn right. All right, see what I got here. What I got here? If you go to uh, my pair, uh oh. If you go to my miscellaneous. Mm-hmm. I ha okay, he's not buying. He's not buying. All right, I'll talk to you later. You're doing business with you. You gotta go see Bellathor. He'd buy a fucking used condom off of me. He'll buy anything. Everybody Yo, Bellathor, how you doing? Oh, What's up? Have any questions? Doing pretty good. Everything's for sale, my friend. Everything. If I had a sister, I'd sell her in a second. All right, see, this is what I got. This is what I got going here. Look at this. Look at this. There's gold necklaces. I got three of them. I'll sell them to you for 50. Oh, you got lowball me. All right, 48 gold pieces per necklace. Check this out. Boom, beep, bop. I'm a rich man. Thank you. Thank you, Bellathor. All right, now this one. This one we got here. Look at this. Look at this fine piece of jewelry. Look at this beautiful piece of jewelry. Look at that. Have you ever seen? Look at the inscriptions on that. Huh? That's craftsmanship. Right there. Have you ever seen anything quite that beautiful? Bellathor, are you paying attention? Are you Bellathor, look at me. He's in a trance. He's never seen anything so good in his life. All right, now I notice you're a little bit short. You can't give me the full amount. I will settle. I will settle. How about this? I'll settle for $600 for 20 of them. How about that, huh? Huh? Boom. Right there. I'm a rich man. You're a happy man. You got rings out the ass. Oh. <laughs> you're, a, you're a good guy, Bellathor. Huh? Excellent businessman. Do come back. I will come back. You know, as soon as you get some more money, I'll be right here to do business with you. Excellent guy. What a, what a real fucking... No, you're not wanted here. Okay. Whoa! 
Well, that that ended abruptly. All right, man, I was just walking in there. Shalom, shalom. And this guy was like, uh, listen here, you fitzka. Get the fuck out of here. That uh, made me feel like shit. Well, you know, uh, I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. I still got some rings to hawk, but I think I'm doing all right. Do you get to the Cloud District very often? Oh, what am I saying? Back the fuck up. I just, you see, you see that awestruck look on his face? You know what I did when I moved forward? I opened up my coin purse a little bit. I'll let, um, get a little gander at what I got going on there. Huh? I had 900 bucks. That's more than you got in your little fucking coin purse. I guarantee goddamn tee it. I guarantee fucking tee it. You know how I know it's more? Check this out. Check this out. Hold on. Let's see. Go to, uh, Illusion. Shuckle Shuffle. Right there. All of these. Bah! Look at that. He only has 32 gold. What a fucking idiot. He don't have any fucking money. Get the fuck out of here. 32 gold, my ass. Do you get the gold? This is real. Eat my fucking asshole, kid. Come on, horsey. Let's go home. We've done enough today. Hey, uh, what are you people doing on my property? Hey! Hey! Look, I understand you're fighting and these people are bad. Horse, don't get involved in this. Alright, you know what? Everyone here is about to get their fucking asses kicked. Get off my fucking property. Get off my property. Wherever the Daedra hide... Get out of here. Move. Them into the light. Be gone. What are you doing on my porch? Excuse me, sir. Sir. No. Uh-uh. Nuh-uh. Dude, alright, look. I just got a new spindle for that at Bellathor's. And honestly, I'm still kind of like, um... Sir, get, sir, if you could... <laughs> sir, get off the fucking... Get off the grindstone. And get the fuck off of my property. Okay? There's a time and a place to touch my things... And now is it, ma'am? Are you taking? All come into the light. Looks like I'm having a fucking threesome. This has been a great day, just acquiring shekels left, right, front, and center. But uh, it's time for you to go. Okay. Uh, I, I'm not trying to be a dick or anything. I'm just saying I. Look, I don't want to say it, but I have a date. Okay. I don't. I don't want to say anything. Because I knew you'd be like, oh, what? It's not about me. No, it's not always about you. All right? I have a date. So if you could just go, um, it w I would appreciate it. And don't worry. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay? So uh, I'll just close this, you know. Because <laughs> uh, I have some plans today, tonight. We're going we're gonna to have a fun time. <laughs> and I'll talk to you in the morning. Night-night, buttercup.